Good morning. Today is the 5th of February, and we remember the martyrs of Japan. On this day in 1597, 26 Christians were crucified near the Japanese city of Nagasaki. We remember their faithfulness under great suffering and honor them as the proto-martyrs of Asia. Jesuit missionaries had been active in Japan for over 40 years, and they had converted large numbers from every class of Japanese society. The ruling shogun eventually banned all missionary activity because he feared that the growth of the Christian church among his people would prepare the way for an invasion by Europeans. The Jesuits took care not to offend the shogun, and were able to continue with their work by becoming as much like the Japanese in dress and habits as they could. But in 1593, a group of Franciscans arrived who openly flaunted the decree against missionary activity. The Jesuits tried to warn the newcomers that they were endangering not only themselves, but also the whole Christian enterprise in Japan. The warning went unheeded. Soon afterwards, the shogun ordered the arrest of six Franciscans and 20 Japanese Christians. The Jesuits quietly intervened in an effort to save the prisoners' lives, but the authorities turned a deaf ear to their appeals. The prisoners were subjected to torture and then marched from Osaka to Nagasaki. There, on a hill overlooking the city, they found 26 crosses planted in a row. Each prisoner was tied to his cross, and then the executioner went down the row, piercing each one twice with a spear. After the crucifixions at Nagasaki, the shogun and his successors relented, and the church enjoyed 20 years of peace, but the persecution was renewed in waves during the first half of the 17th century and continued even after Japan's rulers closed their country to foreigners. Nevertheless, when Europeans once again entered Japan in the mid-19th century, they found many pockets of, Jap of Japanese who had persevered in secret, uh, in secret some, living uh, some living vestiges of Christian faith and practice. The sentence of scripture today is, Precious in the sight of the Lord is the death of his servants. Psalm 116, verse 13. We pray together, we bless you, almighty God, for the 26 martyrs of Japan who were crucified on this day because they would not renounce your son. Grant that your church in Japan and your people throughout the world may dwell in peace with their neighbors and continue in steadfast witness to your love. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who, is, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God.